Hey, how's it going? In this video, I'm going to show you how to bulk create your social media content using Canva, Google Sheets, and ChatGPT. So in Canva, you've probably seen templates like this. So we've got a carousel kind of template, which I can fill in manually. I can double click it and I can edit the text like this. You can do that one by one. It's absolutely fine. Nothing wrong with doing that. But when you're creating 30 days of content, sometimes it's a bit laborious to go through one by one, click and edit, click edit, and you know by the end of an hour, you're fried. So it'd be good to create everything in a big batch and you can power that by a spreadsheet. So for example here, we've got carousel number one, and then we've got number two, number three, number four, and number five. And then we've got the kind of follow me for more card you can paste this onto LinkedIn and you can get people engaging with your content. I'm gonna power this by a spreadsheet and I'm gonna create it in bulk. But first I need to think about what type of content I need to populate this with. It's really easy. So I've got my spreadsheet here. I have got column A, which is gonna be the title, which is up here. And I've got column B, which is content two, which I'm going to populate here. And I've got column three, which is going to populate here. And then I have column four, which will update this part here. And then I've got column five, which is this bit of paragraph here. So I've been developing a prompt in ChatGPT, which does all of this for me, which I paste into a spreadsheet, and then I can bulk upload it to Canva, and it will create a nice lot of content for me. So I'll show you how this works. If we go to this prompt here, you can see here, I've told it it's a social media copywriter. The secret with ChatGPT, you need to give it a kind of a definition of what it is. If you just say, write me social media content, you'll get pretty loose results. If you tell it exactly what it is, you'll get as good as you put in. So I've told it it's a social media copywriter. I will give you a topic and from that topic, you'll create the following. So we need five bits of content and I've told it very specifically about the type of content it needs to create. So the first bit is a title, which is what we need for post number one, then a very short actionable tip about the topic, then another short actionable sentence about the topic, then a motivational but extremely short statement about the topic, and then one extremely short sentence about the topic. If we look at the space we've got to work with, we've got a title here, which you know, hopefully titles should be kind of a similar length. We can always change that in the prompt. Then we need a short bit of content here. We need another short bit of content. Then we need a very short statement as in like, don't quit. So we need to populate this. Then we got our paragraph, which links to this part here. Um, extremely short sentence. And then it will generate the rest for us. So let's give that a go. I'm going to put this in. And we'll do a brand new one here and I'll paste this into here. So the first topic is going to be about growing businesses with social media. The next topic is going to be scaling an online business. And the third topic is going to be about customer acquisition. And that should be enough for this tutorial. So this will generate me three spreadsheets worth of content. So if we let this run, shouldn't take very long. Here we go. So you can see it started generating the tables, which I'm then going to copy and paste into Google Sheets. This is the great thing with ChatGPT. So we have got this information here. If you copy and paste, it's going to copy the formatting, which we don't want. So when you paste, just make sure you um, paste it in without the formatting, otherwise it might go a bit skew with. So let's have a look to see if this is matched what we've asked for. So. We have got growing businesses, amplify your brand's presence, tip, use eye-catching visuals, engage with the following by responding to messages. And number five is your social media success awaits. And then what if we got a number six? Let's have a look here. It's just the great things we're doing live tutorials. And sometimes it goes a bit skew with, but that's just the nature of doing this stuff. So where is consistency? Oh, okay. I can't count. 
but let's try this. So we have got my spreadsheet here and we'll just call this content. And I'm going to download this as CSV. So what I'm going to do now, I am going to use the bulk import tool on Canva. Most people don't know this exists. And I know that sounds very engagement baity, but it's true. Uh, not many people do. And it's completely free with inside Canva. So we go to bulk create. What we can do is upload a CSV. So I've just downloaded a CSV called content. So as you can see, I've now uploaded my content into here. In these titles and bits of content, we need to map it to the data fields which we have available. So this one here, if we right click and we do connect data, we need to connect it to title one. So as you can see here, title one now matches here. So anything I have in title one, which is gonna be in here, it will now turn it into the content I have available in the spreadsheet. And if we go down to this one here, we right click, we connect data and it will be content too. So this part here, if we go down to number three, connect data and we map that to content three, this is our short statement. So we connect data and it's content four. And this one here will be Let's have a look, content five, I believe. Cool. So if we now press continue, it's going to generate a load of content all in one go for me. Let's just see what happens. And what we want to do is we want to take all of the data we've done and generate that social media content. Let's just have a look. So we have got Growing businesses with social media, if we come back to here, this is title one, which is looking good. It's all in the correct place. I didn't need to edit that manually. Then we've got amplify your brand's presence, which is number two. And then we've got number three, which is, you know, use eye-catching visuals to grab your audience's attention, which is here. And this one here hasn't quite gone to plan. So we just need to make the text a little bit smaller, but that's just trial and error. So that one is number four. And then we've got number five and then follow me for more. And then we've got the next carousel here, scaling an online business. And then we've got skyrocket your online venture. And then a little tip, automate your repetitive task and save time and resources, which is great. Here, if the text is too big again, so we just need to make that smaller so it fits. That will do for now, which is great. And then we've got a next little paragraph here, which is uh, down here somewhere. Optimize your website, I think. Oh no, scale to new heights of success. Oh no, we're over here now. And then we've got the follow me for more. And then we've got the next carousel about customer acquisition. Win over your ideal customers. And then tip to offer incentives to attract new customers. This bit of text needs to be resized again, which is fine. And then we've got next little paragraph. And then follow me for more. So within that time of talking, eight minutes and 46 seconds, we have got three carousels completely generated for us with barely any work. All I had to do before this video was just create a template. And to be honest, I just stole it from here, wherever it's gone. I've lost it. Um, it's one of these templates anyway, and I just changed the colors just to make it you know, a bit more in line of what I'm trying to teach. So. If we go back to ChatGPT, we take this prompt here, we put this in, all you need to do is change what the topics are about and how many variations you want. So if we run this again, it'll be a slightly different variation of what we got the first time. And now we need to tell it if we want more, say we want like 30 days worth of content. See what happens. Here we go. 
Basically, this is your content completely supercharged. You can plug this spreadsheet into Canva. You can generate 30 days worth of content in about a quarter of an hour of work, which is incredible. I hope you liked this video. If you found it useful, drop me a follow, like, subscribe, uh, leave a comment on them below. It'll be really appreciated. Anyway, chat soon.